Okay, Matt. <clears throat> this is uh, this was yesterday. Let's just watch this normal speed. And then there are a few things I just wanted to point out to you. You can be working on. Okay. So let me go back here. Let's talk about the. Let's talk about where you are getting to at the catch first of all. Okay. If we go out to the catch, let's just stop it <clears throat> here. Okay. Beautiful. Great reach. Okay, great extension. However, look at that uh, over compression of your legs. Because of that, you can see you're at your, the angle that you're getting with your legs is <clears throat> not a powerful one. So that's always going to mean that you're a little bit slow out of the catch. All right, until you start accelerating. Uh, until you get back into a powerful leg position, it's going to be hard for you to really pick the boat up. Okay. Conversely, or just throw these away, <clears throat> I believe you could get more, that's not what I meant to do. I feel like if instead of getting this uh, over compression with the legs, if you got a little bit more reach with your body, okay, you could still get out to the cage and be in a more powerful position. You may not get all the way to the cage, but you'll be... When I say the cage, I mean out here. Um, but you'll be in a more powerful position when you get there. So that's one thing. Try not to overcompress the legs. <clears throat> get into a powerful position. Now, if we just if we just uh, walk through now, walk through the stroke, okay? By the time your legs get vertical, right there, okay, right about there, all right, you are pretty much <clears throat> your body is pretty much straight up and down, okay? Which means you're using your back too early. And one of the consequences <clears throat> as we go through the drive, okay, is that when you get to here, all right, your back is already done. By the time your legs get down, your back is done, which means you've got this whole distance from here to here to just pull with your hands, uh, with your arms, which while massive are not nearly as powerful as your back um, is. So delay, <clears throat> the, what I'm trying to tell you is obviously delay the backswing. Don't open it up early. Okay, delay it, delay it, delay it. If we find you're shooting the tail, we'll talk about it. Okay, <clears throat> the last thing I want to show you is this extra little bit you're doing with your hands. Okay, great. Right there, okay, is where you should be, right there, is where you should be thinking about pushing down and away. Okay, you're, <clears throat> you're done your stroke at that point. But I want you to see how much more you try to do. You go from here up with your hands. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, that is extraneous and unnecessary and is really slowing you down. You do the same thing in the boat and you could get rid of that, be able to row at a higher rating and focus your energy on the more powerful parts of the stroke. All right, hope that's helpful.